Hey, hello everyone. Uh, so today I'm going to show you how to use XML to plot the histogram of a data set uh, which includes multiple variables. Okay. So uh, obviously you need to have the XML installed on the uh, computer. That's a S in a function of the Microsoft Excel. So you can see a data mining uh, uh, button right here and all the uh, functionality of the uh, software is activated so you have the license for it. Uh, normally you have a 15 day of the uh, trial uh, but uh, uh, you also can purchase the license as well. So in order to plot the histogram of the data set include multiple variables uh, we click use the explore uh, just wider and then what we're looking for that gonna be histogram over here so the um, box right here could allow us to select what the area of the data we want to plot so we click over here and you can select the first one and you can drag all the way to the bottom one all right so you can see the uh, data selection have been displayed over here so um, that's good. So we're gonna have multiple variables, and so each variable have the multiple uh, range of the uh, data points, right? Um, so we can click next. What we're looking for the frequency. Uh, for the x-axis selection, so we're gonna select the first one, but all the variable have been selected right here. Gonna be available for us to change once the uh, histogram uh, uh, graph display. Okay, let's show it later on. Uh, we don't want to color, uh, so no, no color selected, and then finish. There you go. All right. Um, so in this case, you see over here that's gonna be the histogram of the variable calorie, and the uh, uh, y-axis right here that frequency uh, in both the scale that percentage, also in terms of the uh, account as well. So if you want to change different variables, you can select over here that will be for protein Click over here that fat and so on right so this is really uh, convenient when you have multiple variables and you want to explore how the data uh, or distribution of the data look like um, so uh, this is this, this, this easy tool to use and uh, I think that's gonna help you to uh, quickly explore the data and so I uh, determine what will be the next step. Okay, so uh, that's it for this video. Uh, please let me know if you have any questions. Uh, thanks a lot for the watching.